Hello everybody, my name is Klaus, and welcome back for some more Norse Inquisition. I am joined, as always, by my friend Abbott. Say hello. Hello. And uh, hey, I this see... this supposed to be my episode? I don't know, it's, uh, it's 28. You just did 27. Oh, okay, okay. Get your, own, get your own episode. Man, they all blend together after a while playing. They do, they do. Don't worry. <laughs> At least I hope. I hope this is 28. Damn it, now you're gonna make me check. Yep. Yep, this is 28. Okay, let's see what I can do with this peace deal. Bobber's vassal. You can do nothing. Oh, they won't accept it yet. Oh, and the army is I'm really back. I'm close to just declaring on Haishi. Are you still allied? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Just because? Yeah, and they're Vajrayana. They stop, they stop me. And I need to... Maybe what I do is I go to war with them and then be like, Yeah, you're, uh, you have to become Norse now. You're their only ally, though? I don't understand how Jianzhou took that land then, if Haichi had it all. Maybe I just missed something. I wasn't paying attention to it up there. He attacked him at the same time. Did what I did. Looks like I might have actually kept these rebels in check. You're not going too nuts. Ooh. Kagayan lives. Unfortunately, so does Sulu. I know they were in a war. I guess that didn't go. Oh no, they're still in a war with Sulu. How are they not? These must be some serious troops on that little island. To be holding off Kageyan with their 13 troops over here, which are Western. Western troops. Jeez. I don't know. I need to, like, get on Sakam in Taiwan. So that I can try and Westernize off of them. Yeah, you do. So like, this is not this isn't like EU3 then, right? Where you get uh, a colonist just because? Nope. Yeah. Oh, freaking military leader died. That makes my life difficult. <laughs> I wonder what they're going to do with Kyong's song. Because I'm not leaving this siege until I get it. They still don't have it freaking siege. Alright, I'm oh, gonna annex Cheng go. Cheng. How long is that going to take? Oof. It should tell you. Oh, I was doing. I was looking up at the uh, Diplo screen while they were doing it. Okay. Uh, fifty-nine. So eleven years. That's not too bad. Ah, and it just uses two Diplo power each month. So that's good. It's not like you're paying it all off at one time. That's really, really Here's, nice. Oh, that's hilarious. So Japan decided to attack us a attack as well. Korea. Well, aren't they smart? So it's uh, three wars. Oh, man. 
There's... Everybody wants Korea. I don't know what your guys' problem is. This is bad luck territory, and you know it. Sorry for anyone on the stream. I didn't mean to cough. It just happened. Well, it sounded like you didn't say anything, but said something at the same time. Did you just say something about coughing? I did cough. Oh, okay. I didn't hear it. Oh, on my stream. Okay. Did hi she? What? Did yeah, they it looks like they pieced out. Oh, no, I... you're at, you're at war with Hai Chi then. Did they become a fucking vassal? They did. You got what you no. wanted. Go, go, go wreck face, man. Show, show them, show them who's boss. Show them who's boss. Oh, I'm spazzing out over here. I'm gonna calm down. Oh, I can't. Dude, they are just little bastards. I can't. I, I'm in shock that they did that. I am in absolute shock. It's almost as bad as my decision to vassalize Dive Yet while they were at war with Khmer. And that wasn't even that they hard of a war. For Yati, you will die too. Oh, yay. Peasants. Oh, ye peasants. Go. Go help them out. I shall dispatch the troops. Okay, let's see how we're doing. How close are we getting to 11 here? Colonial range more. Eh. Ooh. Yeah, the next military idea, that's where it's going to be at. Freaking asking for military access from me. Screw you, Japan. I want you dead. Not you taking tell my them. land. Ah. Uh. All right, so uh, we didn't mess around with the uh, ideas too much, Cuttlefish. We have a unit pride for plus 10 morale of armies. I think that's standard. I just upped it to level two. Uh, we have efficient tax administration for 10% uh, national tax modifier. Uh, I moved down the stability cost modifier. I also think that was uh, there before as well. Uh, naval principles, morale of navies, this was also there. Um, Guaranteed freedoms, national unrest. I believe I put that one in there because I had some issues with national unrest in a couple games before this. Uh, so I decided to throw that one in there. And uh, mercantile system, plus 5% global trade power uh, because we are sitting on quite a few trade nodes over here. That's pretty good. And evolving trade. Again, more trade ideas. Uh, the traditions that we have are uh, production efficiency plus 5% and discipline plus 5%. Uh, and oh, yeah. when we have gained all of the ideas, we're going to get land maintenance modifier minus 5%. So, uh, I am about to squish Taishi's army. They will fear my might. Good. Freaking making a vassal out of my territory. You're dead. How did they get that before I got there? That's quite odd. Huh. Well, I suppose it is what it is. Oh, yeah. That is the thing. This is the Norse Inquisition called Fish Man. So, whoops, wrong button. 
yeah, we are Norse and, and, and we're spreading it. We uh we had another viewer. Um, his name is Deadlock. I don't believe he is in the stream today, uh, but he was playing this nation down here. And uh, yeah, fair, fairly white. We're going to try and knock out all of the uh, confusion. And uh, if it doesn't get too dry, we're also going to go after the uh, Vrajrayana and Theravada. Um, get rid of that Confucianism and the Buddhism. And I don't know if we might, uh, we might even try and go east or sorry, west. It's not a whole lot to the east. There is a lot to the west. Um, but I think, what, 100 years have passed? And we've gone from like little yep. countries right there-ish to where we are now. Um, so to expect to get over all the way to Europe might be asking a little too much. We thought about maybe just kind of making little ports we could hop to and make our way over there. But we'll see how it goes. This is um, this is far from being fleshed out, in my opinion, which is kind of nice that it's open. Lots of things we can keep doing. Oh, look at you. Hai Chi. Too bad, Hai Chi. Yeah, and there wouldn't have been a problem if they had just leave the stuff I wanted alone. And you're not at war. Yeah, good. You're not at war with Japan either. Okay, that's good. You I definitely... will be if I uh, vassalize uh, Vietnam. Or Korea, I mean, you, not Vietnam. Yeah. yeah, Vietnam's Vietnam is mine. They'll have to end the war with... Uh, Leave me alone with my Vietnam. Uh, okay, let's see. Ooh, he is going slow. Slow, slow. And some culture conversions. These guys are about to go... Uh, well, I got guys there. Should move them there, though. Hey, Mongolia, I know you hate me, but give me military access now. Holy crap. Come on, guys. You can see that better. I believe in you. <clears throat> Looks like it's time for another barracks somewhere nice. Okay. 250, 250. I don't have any 375s left. Well, that's unfortunate. Yeah. Well, we were there waiting for you. Mm, doing better in Haiphong. That's for sure. Ooh, it's a little, a little bit of a slugfest over there. Once we finish these guys off, we can always just go and reinforce. We just got back for some pretty bad uh, revolts earlier, so I don't want to have to dig deep into the manpower. Oh, you better not. You better not. Come on. Come on. Come on, you're like you're like dead. There you go. Stay in it, buddy. Stay in it. Who are you fighting? Rebels. This is an important one. There we go. There we go. Ah, thank God. Man, they took, uh, took a decent chunk out of me. That is for sure. Uh, UA Separatists. Why are you... Oh, I'm still converting that culture. Okay, so that's no big deal. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Enemies, you're going to rise up there. That's fine. This is really where I need to watch out. All right, so let's pop them over here. And you can go move up now. Okay, let's see how close we are to some wonderful technology. Very, very close to those courthouses, which will be nice. We can lower that unrest. 
Manpower took a bit of a hit. And the other thing that's going to be nice coming up is some more military tech. Ooh, look at you. You still haven't got... Ah, 49% on that siege, though. You'll have that in a bit. You're going to have to, I guess... I'm taking some... Oh, wow. up there. You should just take every... Well, I don't know. That might be bad. How much manpower do you have? I have 16,699. That's not too bad. You could probably... Do you have a lot of uh, admin tech? Admin tech? Yeah. No. Oh, okay. Never you mind. Was, power? Uh, yeah, sorry. Admin power. I'm at 262, so it's not bad. Yeah, it's not too bad. I was going to say you could take a whole lot of land, but yeah, if you don't have the admin for it. I at Haya, I would like you to keep liking me. Yeah, I'm gonna use I at Haya for some fun over here in a little bit. Let's see. How long does my claim last? Until 71. Okay, we got some time. We got plenty of time. Do you have enough? Guys sieging uh, Guren? Wait. Yeah. Oh, okay. Whoa, whoa. Sieging Guren. Uh, Cern? Zirin? No, Guren. I could be saying it wrong. But... Is that... Does that have a fort? Yeah, it does. Huh. The other one I can see your progress. I can't see it on this one. It's at 28%. Yeah, oh. plenty. Uh, let's see. Trade, trade anybody? Trade. Uh, three point eight. Anyone better than three point eight? Three point eight. Four point four. There you go. What do you do in Japan? Get the hell out of there! You're not getting anything there. Ah, uh, don't sound so sure. They can't siege it. I have it sieged. <laughs> oh wait, that's a fort. I need to get a uh, troops on there. Hmm. Well, the Meowies are gone. I'm going to pull these guys back to Jian. Hmm. Yeah, it'd be enough to cover, but... Oof. Goodbye, manpower. That leader must have been pretty good. Oh shit, I'm gonna be traveling. Ah, oh, damn it. I don't wanna do that, but. Interesting. Let's see what Haishia say. Don't know. Priya will see Hongkiong, Beijing. Okay. Haishia say. Hmm. Hmm. Hmm.
Oh, interesting. I didn't realize the level of depth that Vassals had in uh, in EU4. Man, I'm so st I'm so stuck in the past with EU3. You can make them into march marches too. Yeah, Which but cool. you can't um, annex them, right? Once you turn them into a march. Um, that I'm not sure about. But a march will Don't give you a can. whole lot of uh, power. They'll be powerful. You just won't get crap for. Um, you won't get any money out of them, but they will have a huge army that they can use. Yeah, I'd rather have the money to be honest. I mean, it's not a whole lot of money either way, but um, yeah, I'm all good. I'll just keep them where they are because I. I, I recall, at least at some point, if you made them a march, you couldn't annex them. Pretty sure. If someone in the chat knows otherwise, then I will believe Abbott when you confirm that. But I'm pretty sure... Pretty sure that you get stuck in some way or another on that. Uh, who's going to rise up now? The enemies... Uh, I want that military tech, so... Ugh. Well, I'm attacking for Yati. Yati, yeah. I mean... You can't just take Hai Chi right now? Uh, I'm at 78% war score. Yeah, I, I guess if... I get the uh, 100. Yeah, I guess if you're already up there. Just be safe. Especially to see if I can get him as a bass. <laughs> True. Alright, let's okay. see what we can do. Going back to war against them. Ooh, 21. You go down. So that should push the unrest up. Oh. That's not that bad. Okay. I'm going to go for higher uh, actual tech this time. Ah, thank you very much, a well-trained ferret. Okay, so we're both right. A well-trained ferret has spoken. You cannot annex a march, but... Oh, thank you. But they made it so that you can revoke that march status and then annex them once the diplomatic penalty wears off. So... They made it... They made it so... Number one. That is good to know. Maybe... Uh, I don't know. I like Divey at all small. Let's see. You could do that. Yeah, that's some aggressive expansion. Khmer, I'd hire... Ooh. That is some serious... Aggressive expansion. And who are you allied with? Nobody. Ooh. That is tempting. Super tempting. Why are those taking so long to get over there? Jesus. Those are big provinces, man. Yeah, they are. Uh, the ideas, man, they're just... It's, it's like they're taunting me. It's like, oh, you can you can do me now. You have uh, bad provinces either. Oh, uh, I should probably get up there. Ah, uh, stop. Stop your timer. Go. Wait, we should wait until this is actually done. 
Yep. Let me uh, finish oh, up my war. Sorry, I was trying to put it on speed two. I guess I never put that up to speed two this episode. That is probably we're at a higher speed. Uh, maybe it maybe it popped back down. Who knows? Tender rebels, uh, get out of here. Yeah. Get out of town. You have higher morale than me. Not going to be a huge issue. Where are you going, Nam Ning? I'm about to die, Nam Ning. There we go. You are very welcome, Chen Sheng. Can't have them losing anything. I gotta annex them. Enemies, Tanhua. All right, is there something I can do over here? Can I? No, you don't have the autonomies. Ooh, what can I get? Diplo. Oh, admin. Great. There we go. Let's see, Ning Chao. Then what we're gonna do? Well, I am eight years ahead of time in diplomatic. I have uh, twelve. Nice. Diplo twelve. Very nice. Whoops. Uh, close to getting diplo uh, military eleven, not diplo. Ooh. This could hurt, but we're gonna do it anyway. Two thirty four. Oh. Okay, never mind. I gotta wait a little bit. Yue and enemies. The Mahayana, they're coming too. They'll go back down in a little bit. Hmm. Oh, oh. Yeah, we gotta end the episode. Winter Siege. <laughs> I totally forgot. Let's bite our time. Holy moly. Alright. We'll end it here.